Romelu Lukaku was to once again terrorise Serie A defences, this time he would do so in Roma colours, but the Belgian would have to wait to make his Giallorossi bow. Milan descended on the capital in red-hot form, aiming to pull eight points clear of their opponents. No wins in our first two games is very unlike us, so playing against a direct rival in AC Milan is, was always an important game, but the fact that we obviously we need, we need the three points, the, the importance is even bigger for us. We've been very focused. We know that they haven't had the best start, so they want to want to have a big performance tonight, and yeah, we want to carry on, carry on winning and keep our form going. So we feel like it's a big game tonight before before the break to to go into the break with a good feeling. We've had to wait a couple of weeks, but it's now time for the first heavyweight clash of the new season. It's last season's Champions League semi-finalists against last season's Europa League finalists. But quite simply, it is Roma Milan under the lights on this Friday night. Loftus-Cheek, there's that change of pace. He gets the return from Giroud. Loftus-Cheek, he must score. What a challenge that is from Zeki Celik getting back in. The referee is going across to have a look as to whether Ruben Loftus-Cheek was caught by Rui Patricio here. There's the right leg out, which catches the shin. Roma's goalkeeper is culpable here. He's given away an early penalty to Milan. Up steps Giroud, and he scores again. Just like his two goals against Torino. Give Olivier Giroud the chance from the penalty spot. And he will take the opportunity with both hands. Reinders. Calabria with the ball in. Rafael Liao, that's absolutely sensational. He had fallen over, he had lost his balance. And yet somehow he stuck out a right leg and volleyed it past Rui Patricio. Milan surfing on the crest of a wave at the start of this season. And Rafael Liao has scored a goal that not even he probably thought possible. Belotti. That's a foul by Tamori, who's already been booked. And Roma rightly asked for the second yellow. Milan down to 10. And is that the change in the game that Roma required? And it is time for the debut of Romelu Lukaku. Spinazzola driving at Calabria. Spinazzola for Belotti and now Lukaku. That would have been a good start. Bove though for Spinazzola. Spinazzola cutting inside and they do have one back. This time Mignon couldn't get in the way. And Leonardo Spinazzola in added time brings Roma back to within one goal. Milan hang on. It's three wins from three from the Rossoneri to start the season. Roma with just one point from three matches. They're still winless. La squadra ha fatto un grande lavoro. Vittoria importante qua alla Roma, sempre una partita importante. È molto contento della mia squadra che abbiamo raggiunto i tre punti di stare primo in classifica. Isolati, sono molto contento anche per, per aver fatto un gran gol. Un'altra sconfitta, insomma, siamo partiti bene, abbiamo fatto solo un punto le prime tre. Adesso c'è la pausa nazionale, abbiamo tempo di, di metterci un po' lì, di, insomma, adesso pensare, pensare a rimettere bene le cose in chiaro e nella seconda, nella seconda parte bisogna fare meglio sicuramente. Sono molto soddisfatto della prestazione della squadra perché abbiamo giocato con, eh, con fiducia, con, eh, con personalità, abbiamo controllato la partita, abbiamo palleggiato quando è il momento di palleggiare, abbiamo affondato quando abbiamo trovato gli spazi necessari e poi abbiamo sofferto giustamente in inferiorità numerica ma sofferto bene con personalità, con, eh, con lo spirito giusto, con generosità, quindi una vittoria sicuramente importante che dà continuità alle buone prestazioni che, che stiamo facendo.